nestled in commercial crab tribes. Well, new regulations in Oregon are aimed at reducing that number while also minimizing the legal liability crab fishermen could face if a whale dies. Changes would include eliminating a two-week period at the end of the crab season for fishermen to remove their gear and adding identification tags to the gear of non-commercial crab fishermen. These regulations will help us uh, make sure that all of Oregon's fishing gear are marked, and that will better help us track where and, uh, where and when fishing gear is out in the ocean and in Oregon's estuaries. And the regulations will also give fishermen protections. And if a whale dies in a trap, it's especially important because of a lawsuit filed by an environmental group in California. Fish and wildlife officials would like to hear from the public before any final decisions are made. So they're going to be holding a hearing tomorrow night at the Hatfield Marine Visitor Center in Newport. Uh